Hey everyone, it is time for Art Ventures and I am on the third floor at Town Hall and this is going to be probably the fastest video that I've done for you for an Art Ventures. Super quick, super easy, super cool, so that's good. Now, if you did not get a kit from me here, uh, pretty much all you need to do is cut out a flower from a piece of paper. Any kind of paper should work. Um, if you got a kit from me, Basically, I just gave you a printout of a flower. So first thing you need to do, since this is Art Ventures, we like to be artistic and creative. So I want you to color your flower. You could use crayons, you could use color pencils, you could use markers. So let's go ahead and do that first. So go ahead and get out your flower, if you got it from me, and go ahead and color it, okay? Try to stain the lines, try to make it look perfect. This is your one and only chance to make the best flower ever. Try to stain the lines. You're just gonna love this little trick I have for you. We're calling it flower magic. Oh yeah. Now the flower is not going to fly. The flower is not going to disappear. The flower is not going to spit out pieces of candy or turn into money. It's not that kind of magic. It's just, Super quick, super fun magic that happens so fast. Don't blink because you'll miss it, okay? Can you hear me scribbling? Because I know you have school to do. A lot of you are doing online school. So this is your five minute brain break, right? So you're gonna need some scissors too. So if you don't have any scissors, grab some scissors. And then you will also need a bowl of water now, since I'm at Town Hall, I got the fine china only available at Town Hall. So I do have a fancy bowl of water. You might not have a bowl that fancy at your house and that's fine. It's not a competition. So you just need a tiny little bowl with a tiny bit of water for our magical trick today. Now look at this. This is like the fastest coloring job I've ever done. Do not grade me. Just know that I did a pretty good job of staying in the lines. And if I didn't, I'm going to be cutting this so you're not even gonna know. Okay, here is my perfectly colored flower, right? I have pink and purple, I just chose those colors. They're not my favorite colors, but I just figured I couldn't decide what color to do, so I chose two colors. Because what do I always say? This is your art, so you do it how you want it to be, right? Okay, now I am taking my time cutting because I just want it to look perfect. So I'm going to cut out all of the flower petals. Nice and neat. Now, if you have a friend with you or a brother or a sister, someone that is doing this with you, Everyone may want their own bowl of water, or you might want to do it at separate times. It's up to you. You guys should have a meeting, get a plan, decide how you want to do it, okay? I'm almost there, almost there. And what you could do too, like if you have someone in your family that's not home yet, like if mom or dad is at work, or brother or sister's at school, or grandma's not there today, what you could do is before you get your flower wet, you could trace this one on another piece of paper, or like I said, you can draw it, whatever you're most comfortable with, and then that way you can do this trick more than one time, okay? Don't have to, just an idea. Okay, I'm almost there. Just got these last two little petals to cut out. Okay, here is my cut out flower, okay? Next, what we're gonna do is we're going to go ahead and fold our flower, if I can get this paper out of the way. So basically, I'm going to take one of the petals and fold it in to the center. See, I'm just gonna do that all the way around for every single petal so that they are all pointing to the center of the flower. Almost there, almost there. 
So we're just repeating this little folding pattern, okay? All right, this is where you really have to pay attention, okay? It's folded, right? Are you ready for this? Get your bowl of water. So basically, sometimes at night, um, you go to bed, right? So when you go to bed, what do you do? Watch TV? Play video games? You better not. When you go to bed at night, you close your eyes, right? So sometimes when a flower goes to bed, all of the petals fold in, right? Because they're like, oh, it's cold at night. Like, or I don't want a bird to come eat me tonight. So watch what happens when your flower gets wet. You gotta just be ready for this, people. I'm not kidding. You ready? Get ready for the magic. Can you see? So you put your flower on the water <gasps> right before your very eyes. It is starting to bloom. Look at that. Slowly but surely, the petals are stretching, yawning, saying, oh my gosh, I'm ready for the day. Look at that. This is flower magic. Is that so cool or what? Oh, come on. That's like two minutes of fun for you. Two minutes of fun. Look at that. So try it at home. Let me know what you think. Come back for the next Art Ventures. Bye.